How to define population and the target population in the scientific research? First, let's, uh, let's define some keywords. A population is the entire group of people, things, objects, or anything that the researcher wants to draw conclusions about and it is illustrated in this example as a red square. Target population or sampling frame is a group of people to which the researcher wishes to draw inferences, establish conclusions and to generalize and study findings. This group of people must share the attributes and criteria that the researcher is interested in. It is illustrated in a green square. Accessible populations is a group of people from within a target population that the researcher has a direct access and contact. It is illustrated in a black square. Sampled population in simple words, is that from which a sample is taken. Usually from a target population and it is illustrated in a yellow rectangle. The sample, sample size, is the small group of individuals, participants, respondents, or observations that researcher provide the study data and information. It is illustrated in this example in a white rectangle. Each individual in the sample is called an element. And each element has a numerical value or measure is called a parameter. This is what is population, but who are they? In research, the population is not restricted only to people. It can be anything in which the researcher is interested in, such as countries, organizations, objects, products, events, animals, species, things, novels, plants, newspapers, books, and so on. To understand this lesson quite enough, let's have this example. Investigating the factors affecting EFL students in improving their English pronunciation. So first, let's take Algerian people, for example, but the number is huge and we are not interested in all people. So we will narrow the population only to the students since it's our variable, which in fact they are over than 2 million or the number that we cannot deal with. Therefore, we will narrow the population only to students of English as a second variable, since we are interested in, we are not interested in other students. And this is our population, but the number is still huge. So we will choose students from certain university, for instance, University of Abbas Larur, and then from within we will focus only on one grade or level, first year, second year, third year, master one or master two, EFL students. So let's focus on Master 2 for example and here it is our target population. Finally we will select a group of representatives as a sample size which we will know how to determine the sample size in the next video as well as the sampling techniques. Thank you for watching and listening. <music>